when you think about day to day, the clients that reach out to us and want to know how in the world do I fill a niche role? I've got a role that I've had open for six months, nine months. Heck, I've heard two years, maybe three years. How do I fill this role if I haven't been able to do it? I've tried agency after agency, organization after organization. I've hired an internal team. I've gotten my hiring managers involved in person and I still can't get the, the role filled. In the 19 years I've been in the industry now, the more conversations I've had around where do we go and what do we do with these niche roles has begun to really carve out a segment that I think more recently hasn't been something that really people have paid attention to. And it's, it's boiled down to looking at parallel industries. And you know, parallel industries, you think, okay, well, that's easy. Um, it's my competitors. No, that's not. The competitors are where you want to go first, right? You want to look at your competition. You want to see what's out there and you want to recognize, you know, do I know everybody? Okay, we can do that. We can find the talent that's in our backyard or we can find the talent that is in our top 10 competitors. But after that, you got to get creative. And for so long, we were having conversations with clients about where do we look? What do we look at? Where do we go? And as we have become more global in the world and as we have become much more versed in um, creating candidates that are much more holistic, right? They're much more well-rounded. We've identified that looking at parallel industries for talent, and by that I mean if I'm in um, the automotive space, now I can look at suppliers and see if there's talent that applies. If I'm in the automotive space, maybe I can look at some of the, in, some of the organizations that put not just the engines in our vehicles, but maybe the seats that are in our vehicles or some of the autonomous uh, technology that's in our vehicles. There's talent there that parallels what you're looking for. So it's, it's incredibly important and I think this is eye-opening because it opens up your organization to not just the usual suspects. So now we're going to hiring managers with talent and they're going, I don't know this firm. I'm not familiar with this company. Or why would I hire from X company if I don't know what they do or how is it applicable? And by showing beyond just a title or beyond the company, showing that other organizations in your parallel industries are producing talent that actually is the same function as what you're looking for, you've now taken a very small niche role with a very small runway and you've essentially opened it to, multi, you've taken it from a small city airport to a much larger regional airport. The ability to land a plane in so many more ways than before because we were just looking at one segment, which is your competitors, right? So I think the biggest thing with looking at parallel industries is being open-minded. You have to be open-minded. And I think that the more that we can educate our hiring managers and you know some of our, even our TA leaders, more we can educate on them on looking at parallel industries, the more that it's going to bring down those um, days to fill, right? It's going to open up the number of candidates that you've got. And I, I really don't know that it's been something that I've noticed truly until the past few years because never before have we seen so many niche roles come forward and the strategies to create those the agencies do the same thing. They do the same thing over and over. They tap the same areas, they go to the same places, and they look for those keywords and they look for the things that will jump out because it's what a hiring manager wants to see. If you educate the client and you inform them, you will open their eyes to those parallel industries. Subsequently, it's gonna create such a much larger talent pool that I think will invigorate the position that you've been trying to fill for so many months, or so many years in fact.